There's one of the dinner cruises. That may be the one we went on before last time. But clear video we'll get, so you can kind of see down. That's where they have the luau is down there and all that stuff. What? Oh, you see people in the hot tub? Oh, I, uh, I, oh, there, to the left. You're looking probably to the right a little bit. If you look to the left. Yeah, I can see a couple people in the jacuzzi. I can vaguely imagine that I see two people. Yeah. Well, I mean, I can only see them. Oops. I hope you weren't wasting time with me. Oh. I was trying to zoom in on this and push the button at the wrong time. That's that, uh, I think that's... Maybe the rotating chicken restaurant. Oh yeah, Alex wants eating flu. fried. Ch <laughs> she wants bird flu chicken. They've got a special on bird flu chicken at the <laughs> at the Happy Bar, a Happy Restaurant, or whatever it's called. So here's Mother's room, nice and tidy. We had uh, we had today we had. Uh, food at the Neiman Marcus restaurant. So we had, Alex had clams. Alex had clams and I had a hamburger and mother had the lobster sandwich. Just uh, kind of just show the hallway that's looking down away from the ocean. The elevator actually called the beach elevator, I guess they call it, is right here. Actually, you can see the view. I'll stop. Here's actually the view from the window at the end of the hall. You can see down into the pool area. And see, I think you might be able to see the sand if we look. Yeah. Stand up straight. You can see out onto the sand. It's right in front of the Halicoa. Halicoa's beach. So actually, it's kind of nice to have a, a view out the into the hallway, although it's not a very big window, but you can see a little bit of the surf and, and the turf. See the waves breaking. This will only be interesting to us or me after this trip's over, I imagine, but anyway. So we'll take our ride down the elevator and show you the rest of the back part of the hotel. This is the hallway out to the beach from the elevator downstairs. at this area, go right out into the courtyard here, which goes to the pool area to the left. They have ticket office for Luau and the other stuff, game room for kids. Upstairs, I think is one of the lounges, or one of the restaurants. That's where they have the Luau, is over here. Luau Garden. This is the happy Happy lounge, happy snack bar, happy snack bar. You can actually see a sign here that has the, this shows the facility. Downstairs, the very lower level. And there's a warrior's lounge, which is where they have karaoke. Connected to the building that we're in. And the outdoor walkways and things. And there's the main lobby, the big banyan tree in the courtyard, which is connected to the exchange right there, and the Bebus restaurant and health club. And then they've got the adult pool out that way with the jacuzzi. And then you come around here where we are now. This is the Sunset Lanai with the game room, as I just showed you. 
Waikiki Ballroom is upstairs, and the Coco Cafe is upstairs right above where we are now, the Happy Snack Bar. And that exit we, hallway we came out of is an exit called the Sunset Lanai, yeah. and I'm right there. Yeah. The pool and all that area is yeah, the direction, which we'll show you in a minute. They have pretty good food here. They have various things for breakfast. and They always said they have pretty good fried chicken. That's what Alex is getting, crispy fried chicken. And uh, various different things. It's all pretty good. It's just a snack bar. Really. Then they have the Barefoot Bar, which is out here by the near the pool. Actually, it's not this way. It's around this way. And there's the pool area. And around there, around that corner is the Barefoot Bar where you drink and, and they have entertainment and all that. So it's pretty nice. Here's a view of the tower. Just thought I'd take a picture of that. We're on the sixth floor, so that'd be probably one of these windows here up in that area. We don't, we have a room on that opposite side over there. None of these rooms have windows, apparently, or uh, balconies on this end like the other newer tower which is over there, which you can't quite see. Oh, there it is, right there. Now they have balconies on the end of the building so people can sit out and look at the ocean straight out. But this building is actually closer to the ocean and also very close to the pool, obviously. So that's really nice. And beautiful flowers everywhere, of course. And this amazing stand of bushes here is really something. Hasn't been too windy today, except when it was raining a little bit. But anyway, it's very pretty. Here's the snack bar. There's the fried chicken, <laughs> which we had the other day. Pretty good. Spam. Spam on rice. Liberty will know what that is, probably. Didn't have it, but it looks good. With the fries. Oh, no cash? You got three or four pieces? I thought it was four pieces. Oops. Anyway, <clears throat> oh, actually, there's the sunset. There's the sunset. You could eat your dinner over there by the Barefoot Bar, except they don't have any music going right now. This is just the sign as you get near the pool, showing that the pool is available to U.S. military and their guests, etc., etc. I'd like to show the, I'd like to see the luau area, but I know. I just want to, that's why I want to be able to get in there and see it. This amazing tree here. Unfortunately, the light is not good. It's backlit right now. No, <laughs> you're anxious to eat. I'm only gonna. It's just taking two seconds. I'm just gonna take a couple, just to show the pool area. And this is the barefoot bar. We didn't eat out here yet, or didn't actually. Well, we had drinks out here the first night, actually. This is kind of fun. They've got the bar area right there. Barefoot bar. It's really nice. It's right out in front of the, or in the back of the hotel, I should say. And they have a little snack shack for real quick little bites. It's only open really during the day, I think. But anyway, this bar area is real nice. You're overlooking the ocean. And, you know, it's just a real good spot hang out. We've got rentals and things I think over there maybe. Hopefully maybe tomorrow. Well, I was going to say maybe tomorrow we'd come sit out here but I kind of doubt it. They have a little kiddie pool. Alex is so anxious to eat her chicken. <laughs> she sat down out there and eating her chicken. Anyway, there's the pool. We've got the kind of a side with no sides. You know, they don't have the edge. They have kind of a zero wedge kind of a thing going on there so that you can just walk right into the pool and then big long steps that are like real shallow so you can just walk right in and they have these two archways one over this connection to the other side and lots and lots of chairs and shade everywhere so you can sit shade almost anywhere the shady tables lounges under the shade and sections over here with tables and protection. The beach is just on the other side of those bushes. But uh, then the other side of the pool, way over there is another section 
can't quite see the well you see the water is just very calm right now but that section of the pool is usually a little bit more of the adults kind of stuff but there's plenty of trees and coverage and protection this is all better picture of this tree here and then more tables out this way showers and people people eating their chicken she doesn't know she's on <laughs> uh, see what she's doing there she's so busy shoving that chicken in she loves that fried chicken <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got two scoops of rice and chicken, huh? Well, we can come out here and have a drink later if we want. Of course, you're so busy scarfing. We're going now? Yeah. There's a little better view of the other tower. And we'll take a quick look at the luau area. dollars a day. Beautiful hibiscus. Let's see the color here. How cute. Isn't that pretty? Here's the Luau Garden. Lots of pretty flowers here. Not sure what that is. Really big kind of a flower there. These are pretty. And these things are kind of unusual too. Not really sure what those are. Where's the sure. coffee? Pretty. In my hand. Right here in my hand. <laughs> anyway. Oh, this is pretty. Yeah, I hadn't seen that. Koi pond without the koi. I don't see any fish. We never did go in here in the luau garden, or yeah, I hadn't seen all this. This is probably where they cook the roasted pig. Deal. We have the little hut here for the entertainment. <clears throat> yeah, they probably have the bar there. Oh, they have oh, they're covered. Yeah, smart. We were worried about them the other night. It was all raining. And we kind of wondered if maybe they would have to stop the show. This is very nice. <clears throat> you know? Mm -hmm. it's, of course, it's not, it's not luau tonight, of course. It's only Tuesdays and Thursdays, I believe. So, actually, that's pretty good because it's covered. It's a lot more protected and looks like they have good lighting and things in here. Pretty grass, huh? But yeah, you could get preferred seating right here in the front. That'd be perfect, huh? Really a good setup for a luau. That's very nice, very professional. Of course, the Paradise Luau was nice too, although you were kind of sitting outside. Okay. Is there anything back there? Really pretty grass there, that whole yard area is nice and flat and birds like it I'm sure. Right next to the pig roaster. And that's about it. We're getting ready to leave in two days. We have tomorrow is the pentultimate day, which means the day before the last. <laughs> and uh, and we leave Sunday night. That pond is cute with the little waterfall. Right now the weather's probably 84, which it is all the time. Ranges as low as 82, maybe 79, up to 86 or something. It pretty much stays the same all the time. Humidity is pretty much all the same, even when it's raining or not raining. It seems to be pretty stable. It hasn't been very warm. I mean, it hasn't been too warm or too humid at all, in my opinion. That's the Hawaiian, Hilton Hawaiian Village, one of their towers. They have four or five towers. There's the game room and all that. This is the entrance to the area hallway. It goes to the beach elevator. Here we go down the secret hallway. <laughs> it's like, get smart. There's the beach elevator. Others Mother's room is right across from the elevator on the sixth floor. <laughs> oh, you're talking about the Especially parking break. Yeah. Anyway, beautiful uh, waterfalls coming off the mountains here this morning because of the rain. 
getting some pretty good rain, well, rain up on the mountains. We had a little sprinkles here. Starting to get some more now. Just a little bit, but thought I'd capture these probably simul, uh, kind of spontaneous waterfalls. Well, by the way, we're in Kaneohe at the Botanical Garden. Something Botanical Gardens. Mother has her helmet on. <laughs> anyway, we'll get a few more photos here. There's one. Well, there's three plus one, two, three plus four. There's a fourth one over there. I'll show you a little scene of this here while we're going through until it starts raining they had again. one that was blowing upside down <coughs> yesterday. Or the day All right. was Oh, look at that valley. And then there's a road there. We don't know where that goes. That's and then here's another thing here. It says open night. Oh, this is uh, Kahua Lahua. <laughs> Kualani, Macau. Huh? Look at those that mountains. Means Beautiful. Sorry about the bump. Anyway, we'll see what we can get down here. How much more time do we have? For what? Oh, an hour and twenty minutes. Hour and ten minutes. Uh-oh. They're really coming down now. Pretty good. And we're just it winding our way. Have big drops. Winding our way around, trying to figure out what it is we're seeing other than just a beautiful bunch of gardens. But they're offshoots off the road with little pavilion looking buildings. But we don't know what's in any of them, if anything. keep thinking we're going to get to the end of something. This sounds sort of like something Mother said she did with a restaurant. Here's a bunch of people. No, we didn't do the restaurant. Kahua Nui. Now this is Kahua <laughs> Nui. Whatever Q2 that is. Q2 test. What does that mean? CLT test, whatever that is. Well, I just don't know. There's this what? must be some kind of a private thing. I just don't know. This just looks like restrooms over there and parking. Bunch of cars here. Maybe this is where you park and then hike or something. What would you be doing here in the rain? Well, another. People don't know it's going to rain every time they come. Oh, come on. I don't That's know. all they've talked about for days. I know for sure they don't want you driving on the grass or parking on the grass. Here's a building up here. We're coming just kind of toward we think what we think might be the end here. Although I can't be sure. This may end up in Hawaii, or in Honolulu. <laughs> <laughs> now we're going up some kind of a hill. There's gorillas. We're seeing gorillas and giraffes. Let's see what... Well, we're leaving the rainy side of the island. We've already crossed through the mountains. We're coming down into Honolulu, but it's raining up, up on the hill here. But it looks like it's clear down in Waikiki, possibly. So we might be able to get some clear weather yet in the last day here. Last day before the last day. Tomorrow's our departure day. So anyway, we'll check out the beach here in Honolulu.